Okay, let's create subtractive synth in Pure Data. Create a new patcher and save it as subtractive synth.pd or something along that line. Let's make a noise generator first. Make a new empty object and type in noise tilde. And create times tilde 0.5 because white noise is loud. Create DAC tilde and now we can start patching. Cool, we got ourselves a noise. Let's start sculpting. Okay, low pass filter is called LOP tilde in pure data. The first inlet takes in audio signal, and the second inlet takes in a number value as cutoff frequency parameter. So, patch this low pass filter with the noise object and number object like so, and change the number to let's say 1000. So, 1000 Hz is the cutoff frequency. As we can hear, the sound is muffled because all the frequency contents above 1000 Hz are filtered out. Okay, let's try high pass filter. High pass filter is called hip tilde in PD. And patch it in a similar way as we did with low pass filter. If we set the cutoff frequency to, let's say, 4000 Hz, we cut off all the frequencies below that value away. So you get a very sizzly type sound with no bassiness. The third type of filter that we can use is bandpass filter. It allows certain range of frequencies to go through and filters out everything else. So in pure data, when you set the cutoff frequency as 440 Hz as an example, frequencies below and above are filtered out. The third inlet of this filter gives us the resonance control, which lets us control how far above and below the center frequency the filter will allow sounds to pass. This filter parameter is called the quality factor, or better known as the Q factor. This determines how selective the filter is. The range becomes wider as we lower the value of the Q factor, and higher the Q factor, narrower the filter is. I think it's best that we hear and see it in action to understand what this filter is doing exactly. So let us pick 440 as the cutoff frequency and mess around with the resonance and pay attention to how it sounds and looks. Low pass and high pass filters in pure data do not have Q factor control. Okay, so that is subtractive synthesis in pure data. You can add filters to the additive synth that we made in the previous video and expand your custom synth if you would like. Congratulations! We are officially sound sculptors. I'll see you in the next video.